I hear tell that a video game is going to be played, and it's true. We're playing it. It's Moon. We woke up. What are we doing? I'm noticing that clock. Clock seems to say it's almost the middle of the day. And last time, we did see an indication that maybe there was going to be a flying bird around here around midday. Why don't we head down here and see if this actually happens? There's just one, you know, there's this one last animal here, this bird. There it is. We found its body. We can see it flying around out there. The body suggests, if we go down here, let's see. See this precious bird at noontime. Well, we can see that it does look like we're at the middle of the day right now. Does this guy ever come down? We can see the shadow high above. Or is there something that we need to do to bring him down? Unsure. Unsure. He, clearly, he's not doing anything different right now. But it is past noon at this point, because time travels very fast. If we just sit, sat and wait, would he do anything? Would he do anything different? I mean, I always have been moving around when going past this guy. I've never sat and took my time. But it doesn't really seem like anything different's going to happen. Or at least not that I can tell. Maybe we would just have to sit and wait the whole day and see if he does anything. Or would, I ha would it be possible to lure some sort of prey here for the bird to notice? Well, the bird's gone now. But there's always the next day, isn't there? Yes. Yes, there is. We could go back to Technopolis. For right now, let's head over here. And of course, there are these, these guys making their sounds. Still have not gotten really an indication on what we should do with them. Doesn't really seem like we can interact with them. Let's go to this guy. He feels good. I do want to buy. He's selling it all, and when he says it all, he means actually just the one thing. Just the one thing. All right, get a couple of these. Well, actually, should we, uh, let's see something. Should we keep going to the left? There's fireworks guy, but we don't know how to make the master firework, which we suspect is something we need for the rocket. There's also American House. I think we've probably done everything we can do at American House, as far as I know. There's also the other guy all the way on the left here who does not like us. And we did find the body of one monster by its property. And we did use this to find out uh, some sort of password for an elevator. They're still saying the same thing, even though it's night. Still don't really know who we're listening to. <laughs> yep, he's still awake. There we go. That windmill was making some noise. Alright, what can we find in here? Beloved Shamisen? He heard that.
Well, at least we know how to get in there. Just need this windmill to start going again. I don't know if there's any sort of timing to it. There it is. I guess you just... Every so often, that's gonna happen. I assume he'll wake up if I move around with that off. Yeah, yep. Just one step. nothing in there. The only thing uh, he's acknowledging is the beloved Shamisen. So what could we get from here? Well, it's daytime now. Yep, I broke in your house, old man. Well, we know how to get in there anyway. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Uh, let me get, I guess I got to go around. All right. So we don't need to go in the house for him. We got him. But what can we get in this house? See you later, Block of Tofu. Like, you don't even have a real name. It's just... You're just called Block of Tofu. But what? So I looked in the fridge, I looked in the drawers. Nothing... Didn't acknowledge anything when I did that. The only thing, I looked at the desk and it said, Beloved Shamisen. I didn't see anything else in there. But clearly... Oh wait, am I forgetting the money? How could I forget the money? It's money after all. So... Well, obviously there must be a reason to break in there. But what is the reason? What is in there that we need? Eighty enums. I don't know what this guy might have that would be valuable to us. I thought maybe the reason we were breaking in was to get the, uh, the ghost of Tofu Boy. Actually, it's not, his name's not Tofu Boy, it's just Block of Tofu. But it's not that. There must be something else in there, but I don't know what it is. And whatever it is, is it essential or optional? Well, now that we know how to get in there, I guess we really should do that at some point and just see if there's anything else we can figure out. Maybe there's an item that I need to bring in there and use? I guess that could be possible. All right, you. Would you mind coming down here? Look, I'm helpless prey. Oh no, I hurt my leg. What? I'm. What can I do? I cannot move. Woe is me. I am weak, and not going to be able to fight off any predators that come down to try to get me.
See you later, Shadow Bird. I think that's everyone on this screen. Aside from ghostfish, but ghostfish don't seem to be ghosts we can rescue. I'm sure there's something we can do with them, but... But as far as rescuing monsters, I think that's everyone. Let's see if we can catch some bait before night falls. Company. Oh, too many items. Um, well, I mean, I, I could put this into stock. Well, I mean, I just could get rid of it entirely, I guess. Alright, I am full of bait. Hmm? Wants me to get rid of something else? Uh, well, I guess I could. So fishing, that's something that I haven't really worked out either. But now we have some bait if we want to give it a try. We could go back to Technopolis to try to get that, um, that robot who's charging. Well, I'm not sure what his schedule is of charging. There was also, of course, getting the ingredients for caviar that we heard a noise for last time. And the noise, it might be similar to these fish. Which, I mean, if we're, getting, if we're looking for caviar, I guess that makes sense. But what do we do with the fish to get the caviar? Do we keep bothering the fish until they drop caviar? Doesn't seem like they're really dropping anything. Interacting with them doesn't seem to do anything. So that's something I'm still not sure about. Well, there is our music friend. Hmm, Hole in Your Sock by the Asunaru Boys. What does he, what does our friend think about this one? Hear the review. The sensational Creole mix brings to mind a great expanse of land. Does it? All right, I want to think about land. This one, please. Thank you. All right. This guy is still down. He remains down. We still have not worked out how to get him. Here's the church. Here's Mushroom Cave. Uh, before we go in, let me check something. Uh, check something. Send some things to stock to free up space in our inventory. No, I mean, I think I just ate that, but that's fine. He came back from Star World. I mean, we know all about Star World. That, 
put it in stock. Let's see what we have. Still never figured out what to do with the magnifying glass. All right, let's head inside Mushroom Cave. So this was something that I was, well, was wondering about. I'm still wondering about it. Um, all right, so we got Rock Boy. I think there's just one other. One other monster here, or at least there's one very prominent monster. How's everyone doing? Yeah, it's this guy here, this fish. To 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 turi. All right, so what do we do with this guy? All right, so we were talking to the mushroom people here last time, trying to figure out what their language might mean. So okay, I just type some stuff down here. So one of them says, gives us the information of Kokunte Bama Tona Ponta, Rurunpa Bama Tona Manta, Paranka Bama Tona Tanpa, Satora Bama Tona Sanho, Karente Bama Tona Kanta. Well, one of the rum roms we picked up tells us that Kanta is red, Sanho is black, Ponto is gold, Tampa is white, Monte green. Now, if we get, if we try to give a mushroom to one of these mushroom people, they just say Bama. So maybe Bama means mushroom? Possibly. I mean, if that's what that would be, uh, I guess then maybe we translate these sentences to these. Kokunte mushroom is gold, Rurunpa mushroom is green. Parinka mushroom is white, Satora mushroom is black, Agorinte mushroom is red. I don't know what these these words mean, but maybe that's what this is talking about. But okay, so what is that? What does that mean? Does that mean tell us anything? What does that mean? Well, then this like this other guy who tells us this, right? Domanasa to Totori, Poi Poi Chakunte, Home Bama, Satori Kakunte, Karunte, Rimpe, Paranka, Taro. Uh, well, Totori, this is the fish, right? That's the fish that's in front of us. Bama, I suspect, means mushroom. So this first sentence is talking about the fish and the mushroom, right? And then the second sentence has these words. Satora kakonte, kurunte ruinpa paranka taro. I don't know what taro means, but it has these words which are these up here. So if we look at the order of these words and assign them to colors, uh, we have Satora, black, then gold, green, white, uh, no, no, then green, white, uh, start that over. Black, gold, red, green, white, uh, so that. Now, I don't, I don't know if this is, and this is the answer, if that's what that is. Uh, maybe? Maybe, do we stand in front of the fish and eat these mushrooms? Because I'm not really sure what else this could be saying. Maybe that's what it's saying. Look at my inventory. So I have white... more white I have green that's gold red I need black let's see so we got to look around look for the black mushroom You 
yeah, there's the black mushroom. All right. I'm going to stand in front of this fish. I'm going to say black, eat. I flash black. I'm going to go to gold. Eat this. Well, hi, Florence. All right. Hopefully that means we're on the right track. Uh, I have a red. I have a, a green. I have a white. Hmm, well that did not do anything for the fish. I got a vision uh, of Florence. Why did I get that? Well, I got it when I ate the gold one. Is there something special about the gold one? I know that. I'm just wondering why did you appear before me? You, yes, I, I did know that. Don't mind me. I'm just looking around, finding shrooms. Yep, they apparently think I'm a friend, so I will try to live up to that. That's, it's not really not that bad, Florence. this point I have white so it was a uh, it was gold and black <clears throat> that I need to get 
So black we did just get. Gold, I'm not sure where that is. Red mushroom is over on the right. But we have that. That's not what we need right now. I'm not getting really any prompts. <clears throat> I mean, they're the normal prompts. Oh, no, actually, no. It's not here. Maybe I should go back out and back in? Okay, question mark is there. But we we got a black mushroom before we started eating them, so the black mushroom wouldn't have respawned, which is why we didn't pick one up. But I didn't pick up a gold mushroom. So that means I have to try to... I'm probably going to have to look back to see where the gold mushroom came from. Black mushroom should just be on one of these pads. This one. Alright, gold, but gold mushroom. <clears throat> Where did gold mushroom come from then? Why did we get a vision of Florence when we ate the gold mushroom? It's the only mushroom that's actually resulted in anything. Nothing else has actually had any sort of effect. Like, it makes us turn colors, but that was the only time a mushroom ever did anything aside from that. This was the other side where Haunted Mansion is. And of course, Haunted Mansion has a bunch of ghosts. But we can't get them ghosts until we can get that caviar. So I don't think there's even really a point to heading inside the mansion. Until we found the ingredients for the caviar so we can feed that man, go into his ghost stomach... And then feed him from feed feed him our caviar from inside his ghost stomach, and then perhaps he will release the ghosts. Because I think I think there's like five ghosts in that mansion. Just like five creatures, all set for the plucking, and these creatures each have like descriptions, you know. They all have names and such, but th I guess those descriptions don't really matter. Because they're not like clues on how to release them or anything, I suppose. Since we know where the ghosts are, 
And, uh, we're just gonna have to satisfy this man in order to get those ghosts from him. And that's white mushroom. But white mushroom is something we already had. And the one that we were looking for was gold. Which I'm noticing that I'm just not finding. The other color mushrooms... ...really were not difficult to find. But this gold one... Oh, okay, there there it is. There it is. Um, so let's see. We now have gold, white, red, green, black. Okay, so we got them all. Hey, what do you think about these mushrooms? Yeah? Wait, can you tell me something about it? Yeah, is just is it just this mushroom or Okay, so yes, Bama means mushroom. Means life preserver. A life preserver can save their lives. I, I did give a mushroom to one of them earlier. Helped them out. So are you, are you going to say that about all of them? Anything different here? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, so he's just saying the same thing. I got, like, a weird vision of... of you... when I use this. This, this one in particular. It's just it's the same thing to him. Well, at least, I mean, he confirms for us that it's called, that the Bama does mean mushroom. Well, if these are life preservers, can I, like, give them to the fish? I mean, the fish is dead. It's not like he can use it. Do you want it? No. I, I, I don't think... I, I don't think he needs it. I don't think he needs it. All right. Let's stuff ourselves with mushrooms. Maybe there was something wrong with the order the first time. Black? Do I get a vision if I do this again? Gold? Yes, yes, I see. Yes, exactly. Okay, let's get another one of those gold mushrooms. Uh, I probably will need to leave the area uh, entirely to get it to respawn. I wonder how many of those there are. How many of those visions? Yeah, that one's green inside. Green, that one's green. Here is gold.
I wonder if this is the most amount of time I've spent on any monster. It feels like it is. All right. Black. Gold. All right, nothing happened. So let's keep going on to red. Next one is green. And then lastly, there's white. All right. And I guess that teleported us to the mushroom where the fish corpse is. Mm-hmm. I would love to, yes. Yes. Kakunte. I'm glad we already know the moves. Their chanting sounds odd sounds oddly ominous. Like it doesn't really sound like anything good's happening. Are the skeleton fish its heart? Uh, yeah, sure. How do I gather? All right, I'm back here. Well, I know where those fish are. I just don't know uh, how to gather them. But it looks like that we have made some progress on this giant fish that is entirely too elaborate. It's entirely too elaborate to catch this fish. Okay, I'm now actually touching them. Okay. Let's walk around and see if we can get all these skelefish before we have to go to bed. I mean, we have been wondering this whole game, what are we supposed to be doing with these fish?
how many schools of skellifish are there? I wonder if there's any indication if I've gotten all the fish. Ah, uh, that. I don't need to donate. I already did my donations. We're long done with that. I am a, a premium member, I'll have you know. There is no need for me to donate any more money. sure if there were any other fish there. I didn't see any. But even though we did not actually finish the fish thing, we did rescue some monsters and we should be able to go up another level. It sure is. That's right, Shadowbird. And block of tofu. My love is deepened. I am now a lover. First class. That's right. No second class love here. Not from me. You only get first class love. Okay. All right. So we spent a lot of time in the mushroom cave uh, and worked out something. There was progress. It, it was kind of hard. So we we figured out an order of mushrooms to eat in front of the dead fish in order to transport ourselves. This is, was not to actually save the dead fish, but just to transport ourselves to the mushroom where the dead fish was. And because we were there, we then participated in the ritual to summon the fish's soul. But the fish's soul was in many pieces, so we collected many pieces. I don't know if we collected all of them. I guess we could go back to the mushroom cave and see if all of them are there, or if there's anything else we need to get. Um, so that seems like a big thing, this entirely too elaborate ritual to save this monster. And we were able to save two other monsters while we were at it. Uh, the shadow bird, which that clears out the um, that one particular screen of monsters. Uh, the block of tofu, which was the only monster by that one guy's house. Though we we did get inside his house. We figured it out. I don't know what we need to do inside his house. I don't know what we need to get inside his house. But we got inside that guy's house, and there's nothing he can do about that. And we leveled up. So. I, I want to catch this fish. I want to catch this fish. Why is it so, taking so long to catch the fish? We're going to have to see if there's anything else we need to do to catch this fish. As we continue with, Mo with Moon. Moon. 